is Saturday, June 17th, and it is time for the Metric Century. Woo! I am stoked. I am ready to go, and Susan is on her way. Um, I have had three days off, so my legs are feeling good. Um, I walked the fair on Wednesday for about five miles, so I got some stuff, but Thursday and Friday, totally off, so... It is uh, very crusty out right now, but we've got uh, a heat wave in town that started yesterday, but we're riding along the coast, so it will be like cloudy for the first hour or two, and then we're riding inland. I'm going to try a two-shirt strategy, long sleeves to start with, and then once it clears up and gets hot and sunny, then I'm going to switch off to short sleeves. And we'll see how that goes. I am stoked. I am ready to go. Uh, so let's go. Okay, we're underway. Crusty but nice. 61 degrees. Feeling good. How are you feeling, Susan? I feel great, thank you. All right. It's almost 8 o'clock, we're 9 miles in, setting a good, nice, casual pace. My heart rate average is below 130. The sun is just now starting to break through, I'm trying 61 degrees. Things are all A-OK -okay so far. Okay, 13 miles in, first break for the headband. Things are good, pace is good, the heart rate is good. We're about, I don't know, five miles away from the pier, six miles away from the pier, okay, something like that. Right. Well, actually, no, I guess we're about three miles away from the pier for 13. Make a quick stop there and have some fruit and off we go. All right, 17 miles in, we're at the Oceanside Pier. Both feeling good, good pace. I don't know what we did it in about uh, an hour and 20 minutes or something like that. I don't know what the miles per hour is, but we're not exerting ourselves. So things are looking good. Obviously, you can see that the sun is completely shining. The clouds are absolutely 100% gone. So it's going to start getting warm as we go 10 miles inland, and then we'll come back to here, and then we'll figure out how many miles we did. So. Okay, we're entering Oceanside Harbor, and we're just about to take our second to the last break in here as there's a bench. We are three hours of riding time in, and 
about three and a half hours of elapsed time at just over 36 miles so more than halfway and we've got about 20 miles to get back to our spot so that's 57 so we're going to need to pick up about five miles somewhere once we get back. It's about 70 degrees now, but feels nice and cool, fortunately. So, all good. It's break time, almost 37 miles. Three hours in, uh, well, we got 25 miles left to do. It's good. I don't know, anything else to say? It's a little warm out. It's like 70 degrees. It's good. It's a little humid out. Yeah. There's the view. Just nice. Okay, we're going to have to make up about four miles once we get back. We're at uh, 45 and a half right now, three and, quarter, three and three quarters hours into the trip. Moving time. Good pace. Good stuff. So we're 50 miles in and getting a little lightheaded in here and we're, we're, we're on the home stretch but it's getting a little bit warmer not not really that bad I'm still in long sleeves in here but 
you know, got a little breezy, a little bit of a push, and I'm now at the longest that I've ridden, um, and so just need just a quick break. I needed to get something cold because all my water, I still got some water left, but it's no ice. I've got a frozen Gatorade still on the bottom, but I saw this little store at the camping ground. It's like, perfect, let me get a cold one right here and just drink that. That'll make me feel better. It'll give me a break and I'll still have the ice when we get to Swami's or whatever. So, um, yeah, we're going to do this thing. That's not in doubt in here, but uh, yeah, I just needed a, a quick break right here. So, clear my head, get ready for the final push. Yeah. It's a working weekend. Oh, happy Father's Day. I got it. Look, they even got shoes on them. That's impressive. <laughs> well, we made it back to the start point, and as I suspected, we're just a little bit short, so we're going to backtrack here. We just about two miles short, so we're going to backtrack a mile, pick up the mile, and then we are going to be done. Awesome ride. So we're backtracking, and then we run into the lemonade stand. These nice long days had some great lemonade and some uh -huh. awesome cookies here. What are they? Butterscotch? Peanut butter chip, chocolate chip, white chocolate chip, and milk chocolate chip. Uh -huh. Yeah, they were. <laughs> they were very good. Just what we needed at the end of the ride. So, awesome. That's it. Cross the line. Not quite finished. We're almost there, but 62.2 in uh, five hours and seven minutes of riding and a lapse time of something. So, we got another quarter mile to go to get back to start. Woohoo! Metric century complete. 62.87 miles. Five hours and, uh, I don't know, five hours and 10 minutes or something. Elapsed time of six hours and 40 minutes. A 12.1 mile per hour average. Just amazing. I had to stop a few times because I just got a little lightheaded and stuff. Cut liquids into me and some food and all that kind of good stuff. And yeah, that was awesome. We have a nice breeze. It's not overly hot. So definitely mission accomplished. Woo.